I remember loving this film so much from childhood, but I can't remember the last time that I watched it. And I can feel like my brain is emptying the greatness of this film. Like I can't remember it. And so this is the first time I'm rewatching Brother Bear in probably like 12 or so years. This is a story from long ago when the great mammoth. Is the whole film gonna be in this dimension like a smaller screen? The spirits of our ancestors and that they have the power to make changes in our world. Never try to milk a caribou. <laughs> no, don't, don't, no, come on, don't, no, no, no. Ah. That's you gross. It off. And the air was sweet, and the mountains kissed the... Honestly, Disney don't do music like this anymore. <laughs> like, where, like, where it's not the character, like, singing it. Man and nature live side by side. Phil Collins. <laughs> Phil Collins. The choices we make. He knows no fear, this one. Am I feeling tingly already? <laughs> Just tie it up. Just tie it. Do it. Go back. His fatal flaw. The great spirits reveal to us a totem that helps guide us through our lives. Some of us. Beauty. <laughs> Your totem is. A bear. Love. What? Why are you so disappointed? What's wrong with love? One day you'll be a man. We'll place your mark next to those of our ancestors. Now when you skip around loving everybody, <laughs> you'll smell so sweet. <laughs> Kenai loves me, he loves me not. Kenai loves me, he loves me not. <laughs> brothers being brothers. Eagle of guidance? What does that mean? But now that I'm older, I know it's about being a leader. Do they all have separate ones then? Like no one double ups? When you live by your totem, you will. Really? Guarantee it. <laughs> He's perfect. He's guiding him. Kenai, wait. Kenai! What? You just let him go by himself to get the bear? Where'd he go? If we're lucky, far away. <laughs> Kenai! Yeah, I bet you regret that statement now, eh? Come on, Bear, come this way! Oh my god, wait, one of the brothers die, don't they? <laughs> Which one? I swear one of them dies. It's surely it's got to be the eldest. The wise old eagle of guidance. <laughs> Sit down. Oh, he sacrificed himself. That just got real, real quick. Our brother is dead, and it's because of that monster. I don't blame the bear, Kenai. <laughs> you left too soon, Sitka. Your brothers need your guidance. <laughs> running away. He don't want no harm. Oh my god, the bear. <laughs> Through the heart. The bear ran onto it. And now your spirits transfer. He can't see it. It looks so pretty. The eagle, it's your brother. Actually changed into him. Oh, he's taking you away. <laughs> Oh my god, he's gonna think the bear killed his brother. <laughs> 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 
try to kill him off already. I don't blame the bear, Keen Eye. Now he thinks he's lost two brothers. Now we're in the bear. It's gone full screen. So it kind of feels like the beginning of the film where it was in a smaller dimension. It feels like that was the story, the prologue. Like that was like a start of like a retelling and now we're like in the story. All of a sudden this... <laughs> <laughs> You are going to get a whole new perspective on things. Listen to me. You got yourself into this mess. If you want to change, take it up with your brother's spirit. But back away real slow like. How'd you do that? <laughs> I knew you had him. <laughs> Pine cone breath, crusty tail, twig legs, big nose. <gasps> Sorry. Y you went too far that time. When me and my sister's fine. <laughs> And someone says something about someone's nose, that's when it's the end of the fight. She <laughs> transformed into a bear. Magically. I, I was lifted into the sky by my brother. Sound crazy. But crazy! Is <laughs> it I? Oh, I wouldn't go that way. Bears? <laughs> bear trap. You must be pretty embarrassed. Don't worry. I will tell anyone. I love him. He's so cute. The only way to get down is to chew your own foot off. I don't need some stupid bear's help. My eyes were watering and my tongue was swollen. And from that moment on, I was more careful about... Just let him pass you the stick. You're just a dumb little bear. So there's really no way you're going to be able to... <gasps> How is he love? How is he the totem of love? He's such a hater. I don't want to brag or nothing, but I got some moves. Flying deer of death! Uh-huh. He's coming back! Where? <laughs> Say it with me. Coda! Sure your mom didn't ditch you, Coda? Hmm. It's probably the fifth or sixth most coldest day in my, my entire life. life. Oh, oh, yeah. For some your friends. Oh. <laughs> well, I have to this. this. This, I always watch this clip on YouTube. Tell everybody I'm on my way. Will you, will you... With blue skies ahead, yes, I'm on my way. Tell everybody I'm on my way. I'm loving every step I take. Phil Collins. Not the snow, not the rain can change my mind. There's nowhere I would rather be. I'm on my way now. Oh yeah, Kino. Oh yeah, Coda. <laughs> Lost the hunter back under the glacier. So you don't think you'll follow those? They are great names. <laughs> get out, eh? I'm driving. Surprised they're letting the bears and the moose ride them. Let's get a back seat or something. I look like you hunted me. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Why is Keen Eye like literally bringing like the animals of the forest together? <laughs> That's a strong trunk to lift two mooses. Yes, I love you. I love it so much. Mom says the spirits make all the magical changes in the world. You know, for a change, maybe they could just leave things alone. <laughs> Thanks, Sitka. If it weren't for you, I would have never met Kenai. Mm -hmm. Oh, Cody, you're so adorable. You're such an adorable man cub. <laughs> Bear cub. I spy Tree. some. Oh. Okay, my turn. Tree. No, I got. Oh, it counts. I didn't even spy anything. It counts. <laughs> I think it's that way. You think or you know? Uh, um, you don't know where you are. I don't care about about the time you and Binky found, you know, the world's biggest pine cone ever. It wasn't a pine cone, it was a pine nut. And it was huge, even bigger than your fat head. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry we're lost, okay? Even though it's pretty much your fault. My fault? <laughs> Ugh, that's it. He's got the young brother down. I can't find my mommy. Will you take me to the salmon run? Why don't you just grow up? Fine, I'll just go on my own then. Fine, go ahead. 
Hi. Kunai, that's what you sound like to your older brothers. Mm. Honestly, the hands look like trapped spirits, like trying to break out. <laughs> like, help. Like they're on the other side of the glass. Those monsters are really scary. Especially with those sticks. Exactly. Coda thinks that humans are monsters. Fakina thinks that bears are monsters. I know this place. The salmon runs not far. We just have to go through here. For what? Pit of hell? What? <laughs> you don't see the danger, Coda? It's easy, just don't step on the... Oh, they break from anywhere then. I was going to say, don't step on the green glowy bits. Yeah! <laughs> scared you did not. <laughs> they're scared, and then they're surprised. And you were both. <laughs> <laughs> Whenever someone jump, like, jumps out and scares you, you got to act like you weren't scared. <laughs> you could have just burned your brother. If that's like hot gas. He cannot see that little cub and kill it. Throw Coda across. <laughs> and you just make a run for it. <laughs> He's so pissed he couldn't kill his brother. His brother bear. <sighs> the title. Kenai's gonna like try and like hold on to the the what is it called? The trunk? The tree? Getting up there than it was riding those mammoths. Mammoths? Are you kidding me? Huh? That's kind of weird. That's kind of weird. <laughs> he never sharpened his claws on a tree. He's never hibernated before. He He's an imposter. I don't belong here. Don't belong? Every bear belongs here. Come on! Welcome to our family time. Oh. Such good music. Oh my god, they need a brother bear water water slide, water ride in Disney. Oh. See look how peaceful bears are. They're not dangerous, not ferocious. They don't attack. Let's say welcome to our brotherly time. Just gonna catch it midair. <gasps> Caught one bigger than Coda. That's the biggest one yet. <laughs> Finally knocked down that tree that was blocking the view from my cave. Family of chipmunks stayed in my place. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. I lost my dear husband, Edgar. Quit telling everyone I'm dead. Sometimes but I can still hear his voice. That's from this. I swear I've heard that. I swear I've heard that as like a TikTok audio or something. I didn't know that was from this. Get a cave. Lawyer just said us boys. If only Edgar was alive. I told you, woman, I'm right here. <laughs> exhausting journey I've ever been on with the biggest pain in the neck I've ever met. What do you expect from a little brother? <laughs> a little brother? Oh. This year I watched my mom in a life and death struggle against all odds, battling possibly the most fierce creature on the face of the earth. Okay, who's next? What? Break it down a bit. I oh, want to hear the rest of that one, Coda. I thought you might say that. 
<laughs> it was probably the fifth or sixth. The most coldest day of my anyway. entire life. <laughs> Me and Mom, she says I smell something, so I started sniffing. This is not the story. Running right towards us, getting closer and closer. This ain't the story from the beginning, no way. The monster has her backed up against this giant glacier. Flashback. And they're all around her poking her with sticks. She was just trying to save her baby. She couldn't hold her breath any longer before POW! She burst out of the water. He's a really good storyteller. <laughs> water okay but that's how we got separated right after that i met kenai oh but you ain't seen your mom since why don't you still think she's okay well i i have a story to tell you it's kind of about a man and kind of about a bear mostly it's about a monster and which is which but there's nothing i can say to change the things i've done oh, 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 oh. <laughs> i did something very wrong Brother Bear. Brother Bear. He's the monster. I don't like this story. You trusted me. Your mother's not coming. I killed her. Oh. Oh. And I pray someone, oh. something will come to take away oh. the pain. Like this with the song and just the snow falling. I can't <laughs> face another day. Oh my god. I'm sorry, Coda. So, wait, what story did he tell him? Did he say that I'm originally a human and I killed your mum? Because how would Coda believe that? Sika. So, you're gonna take him to the mountains? From now on, he's my new brother. I don't want any more brothers. See? He's <laughs> had enough of you, too. Because I love you. Excuse me? I don't believe I heard what you said. <laughs> I said Because he love loves you. I love do too, eh? Oh, I love do. <laughs> Tanahi. Sick up! Hurry! Change me back! <laughs> He's gonna like look in his eyes and be like, Can I? Oh my god, he's gonna try and kill Coda. Coda! Ah! It's because Sidka sees that Kenai is showing love and he's gonna release him. You can't communicate with Coda anymore now. Whoa, emotion. <laughs> You can't leave Coda, he's he got no me. one. He did look better as a bear. <laughs> no matter what you choose, you'll always be my little brother. <laughs> oh, the transition. <laughs> I was giving the beast transition into the human. <laughs> did I see little? The big boy. And now you know it's him because he's wearing the totem necklace. It does say Sidka's gonna walk away with the mum. I need me a tissue. I don't even know why I'm crying. Ceremony. He taught me that love is very powerful. Oh my god, he's the one that's been doing the narration. The story of a boy who became a man by becoming a bear. Oh my god, and he already foreshadowed the ending of the paw to the war of hands. He got to be a great older brother whilst also being like still part of the human side, the human brother as well. Songs by Phil Collins. You go, Glen Coco. No fish were harmed during the making of this film. <laughs> <laughs> no, he oh my god. <laughs> and then 
seen that before, I don't think. Ooh. I thought it was going to be like, it was probably the fifth or sixth most coldest day in my entire life. And then like retell the brother bear story. I forgot how good this film was and I forgot how sad it was. I could barely get through the first 10 minutes about like almost tearing up. Did you like that pun? Yeah, it's, it's so good. I love old, old school Disney and I need to watch more films like this that I watched growing up that I like haven't seen in like 15 years. And this was one of the greats. It was, I don't know what you think about Brother Bear. Let me know what you do think about Brother Bear. <laughs> but I really like this film and I'm glad that I watched it again after watching it for a really long time. Let me know if there are any other older Disney films you'd like to see me react to, but that is it for my reaction to Brother Bear and boy. And brother, did this barely killed me off? Uh, I'm out of puns. Thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, please do a like and subscribe for more. Let me know what you thought about Brother Bear and if there are any other Disney films you'd like to see me react to. But thanks for watching. Bye.